Hello Libra, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for October 9th through the 16th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. Alright, I don't know, another uh, person got this too, I don't remember who it was though. But it's like somebody is... um. Just um, not looking at the situation for what it is. And is I feel like it's an ending of a situation, but somebody's trying to act like it's not going to end. Okay? Trying not to see it for what it is. But um, uh, I like to use my Clio cards to end the readings. I want to thank everybody. And I'll read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings. If you like a person reading, check in the uh, description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. All right. What's going on with the Libra? Mm. So you got fake friends talking crap about you behind your back already. Or you could be one of these fake friends. All right. What's going on with the Libra? Libra, Libra. Libra love reading for the week of... October 9th through the 16th, 2017. Libra, Libra, Libra. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we're dealing with uh, uh, some kind of arrogant person who feel like they deserve more than what they get. Okay? So this arrogant person could be you, but it could be both of you guys just wanting more, more, more. So it seems like somebody is in and out, in and out, in and out. Okay, so it could be, um, okay, it seems like somebody's going in and out, and here it seems like, uh, your friends at work, you know, maybe, um, sisters, or this makes me feel like, this really makes me feel like work, but somebody is trying to protect you from this person leaving, leaving and coming back. Yeah, it seems like somebody trying to stop you from dealing with this person, okay? Okay, they basically saying this person has too much baggage. Let's see what this baggage is. What is this baggage for the Libra? What is this baggage for the Libra for the week of October 9th through the 16th, 2017? Yeah. Okay, so it seems like this person may have a new beginning on the side or they possibly may have a baby on a way by somebody else. Okay? And I feel like this is known. This ain't this is this mm. This isn't something that you just found out. You knew this person had somebody on the way and you know that this person is leaving and going away and I feel like sometimes they're going to be with the the parent of the baby. Okay? All right, yeah, this whole situation got you feeling outside of yourself. It got you feeling like low self-esteem. It got you feeling a little angry and irritated, you know? And make you, like, do nasty stuff like lie and just do all kinds of stuff outside of yourself to, um, to make this person stay, to make them not go. Like, you feel crazy, too. Like, I'm getting one of those feelings where your eyebrows won't go down, like... Like, the lies are, like, so big that they can see them. Like, they can see them in your face that you're making it up. But then it's a desperation in there, too, you know? But, I don't know. They they do got a baby on the way, so it's like, what can you do? Or they have a new baby at home. Or they just might have another person. New person. Yeah, so this person has been treating you like they don't want you. And I feel like... That's what these friends are trying to protect you from. They can see where this is going. They see this thing is going south. They see you, uh, like, trying to be with this person. This could be the other way around. It is a general reading. But they see you trying to be with this person, this person trying to be with somebody else, but for the kid, you know? So it's basically like, right now, you haven't found what you need to find to say that you're done with this situation. But I feel like... 
for the other person they are already on they found what they want and it's it's not here okay sorry all right Virgo, Virgo. but this could be you could be either way around yep so that's not a ten of cups somebody is definitely trying to make peace in their home and it's time for you too you know you didn't got outside yourself you just being a little bratty thinking like, okay, even though she got a baby by him or he got a baby on the way by her, I can get them. I can keep them, you know, but in reality, it's like, stop being so spoiled and arrogant. You got to realize that people are going to try to work things out with their kids, even though, you know, it was wrong circumstances. Like if they cheated on you or if they left you for a week, came back and this person was pregnant, whatever the situation is. The first thing that we're programmed to do is try to be there for our kid, even if we don't want to be there for the person. And then the second program is try to save your money. Because if you're not with this person that has a kid by you, guess what? Somebody is going to court pretty soon. Everybody wants to stay out of that courtroom. All right, what's going on for Libra? Libra love reading. Libra love reading. October 9th through the 16th. Libra love reading October 9th through the 16th, 2017. Love reading, love reading, love reading. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Libra. All right, this wants to go out. Yeah, so we got a real caring, sensitive person. And I feel like this might be you just sitting there waiting for this person to do what you think is the right thing. But in this case, what is the right thing? You know? All right. Libra, Libra, Libra. I keep wanting to say Leo. It could be because it's two L's or it could be because you might be dealing with one. Okay. All right. Somebody is ready to fight for what they feel like is theirs. That's right upside with this manipulation card or this um, lack of integrity, low self-esteem. And then you saw the four staffs just now. Unstable relationship, unstable home, you know. All right. So it seems like somebody is fighting for something, but it seems like somebody, you just can't trap them. You can't get them caught in your trap, you know? You're ready to fight, but you just can't trap this person. That's just what I'm seeing when I look at it. E. All right. So it seems like it might be a lot of money going out for some reason. Okay, so in some cases, this person is coming back just to get money from you and then taking it to their house to fix their home. But all together, is just instability in the home, you know? All right, so I'm going to read these straight out the book. All right, there. Okay, so for some of you, this makes me feel like you may end up in court also. You could be dealing with just some kind of, could be anything. It's every sign up there. Instead of a uh, water sign, but let's go. All right, we got the seven of staffs first. Staff, staff, seven. It's upright. It says, keep your strength and beliefs even though others may challenge you. You're right. Even though you are outnumbered, you will win. So, um, yeah, you're going to win something. But I'm not sure if you want to win. I mean, the only person I can see winning here is the parent of the child. All right? So if you're not the parent of the child, you're not going to win. Okay? Yeah, and, and if you do, it's going to be like three to six months of, like, craziness back and forth, you know? I feel struggle big time. I feel tug of war going on. All right. So we got the Eight of Swords reversed. All right. Eight of Swords, Ace. Uh, public embarrassment at the hands of others. A feeling of being held prisoner, trapped by some force. A situation difficult to escape from. Oh my gosh. So this definitely makes me feel like somebody is going to end up in court. Somebody's going to end up in court and they're going to be like just telling all the business and it's going to make people feel crazy. 
or you know uh I feel like somebody might be like confronting somebody out on the street or in public. Like, what are you doing with her? What are you doing with him? Blah, 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 blah. All right. So we got the 10 of coins reversed. And it says a card of violation, theft of some times. No, sometimes gambling or thrill seeking. So it seems like this person the one who got the baggage went off and I feel like they was just doing some crazy stuff. This might be some thrill seeking that they was doing and they end up getting somebody pregnant. Or this person could just have some bad gambling problems. Okay. All right, we're gonna do the emperor. All right, the emperor says, a person who is not afraid to speak their mind, strong beliefs, and does not change their mind easily. Promotion at work, a time for success and advancement, a great chance to make money in a time of power. Oh, my God. This is, like, so all over the place. So it seems like this may just be dealing with work. I feel like money might be going out in this relationship, but... In your work life, you're doing pretty good. But relationship, this is like a whole different struggle. You might be running to work to escape from whatever this is. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.